what is up guys welcome back to another trip to the thrift if you guys are enjoying the videos hit that like button and let me know and it helps the channel grow i'm gonna drop a comment down below i try to respond to all the comments i can and hit that sub button if you guys are not already and you guys do enjoy these videos so let's go see what we can find this week kd6 probably my least favorite kd model personally they want 30 bucks for those here's two items that i thought were pretty cool we got the um green bay packers reggie white reebok jersey they want 20 bucks for it though which really like that's probably about what it's worth Number 92 white on the back. And then the Disney Christopher Robin tee for a $2.99 size medium. Some Kyrie ones, $8.99. They're actually not in bad shape either. Size eight and a half. Found this Nautica Sport Tech long sleeve tee, but they want $6.99 for that one. And it's pretty stained up on the bottom. I don't know what kind of NMDs these are, uh, but they're really beat up. They want $8.99 for them. I don't really pick up NMDs anymore anyway, but cool colorway. Found this 2012 Chelsea jersey, size small, $3.99. No name on the back, just the big Adidas logo. Found this split skateboarding tee. You have like the skull with the split logo. $1.99 size XL. It does have like some bleach marks down here at the bottom though. And then I found this Sea Ray Teamwork in Action boat tee. I don't know what it is, but I do really like the graphic on it. And then you got it in the front in the pocket. That one's a medium for 95 cents on that older Gildan tag. Here's this pit bull tee I found. <laughs> the strongest and most powerful since 1999. You just got them on the front there. That one's a size small for $3.99. And on the back, strongest, most powerful since 1999. Found this tee right here, the Godfather. It's not it's not old or nothing. It's from 2008 to 2X. They went four bucks for it. I just really like the big graphic on the front. We got the Blue Man Group New York tee, size large, $1.59. And then on the back, you got them. <laughs> Looking uh, creepy as always. Here's the Hobbit, an unexpected journey tee. That one's a large for $2.99. On the front, you got the big graphic. And then on the back, you got in a hole in the ground, there lived a Hobbit. And then here we have the Van Halen football jersey. Um, I think it's their tour from 2012. They want $6.99 for this one, um, but I'm pretty sure it's worth it. The prices are like all over the place on this one. Like the last couple I saw sale on eBay are like triple digits, so I'm going to have to go ahead and grab that one. And then for $3.99, I found the 2004, the Alamo T. I don't know if y'all remember this movie. Oh, my bad. It's only $1.99. I don't know why I thought it was $3.99. Even better, but uh, size XL on the old all-style tag. Definitely going to go ahead and scoop that one up. I found this majestic uh, St. Louis Cardinals pinstripe jersey. $3.99, size medium. Heather gray with the big patch on the chest. Nobody on the back, unfortunately. And that one is a size medium. Still super clean, too. And then also, I found the drum set for $8.99 for PlayStation. What's funny is it was all in pieces scattered throughout the store, so I had to go on like a scavenger hunt looking for everything. The top part, the drums were right here on the top. <laughs> The legs were in the front and like a cart they just pulled out and then the um, pedal was also in the front. But I managed to piece it all together. Some fire red Jordan 5 lows. Actually a pretty cool colorway. I do like this colorway. They want 13 bucks for them. If they were men's size I'd get them but they're a 7Y. So I might pass on them because they are a little beat up and there's no laces. Found a pair of the Kobe 9 mangoes. Is that what they're called? Size 10. So they are my size. But I don't need them. They are a little beat up, as you guys can see, but they still would make a good hooping shoe. The Hundreds tee, size small for $1.99. This actually used to be one of my favorite brands. I always just like the bomb logo. Got a little Blink-182 tees. Probably go ahead and grab them and just throw them up on Mercari for like 10, 15 bucks a piece. And then use that money to buy something I actually want. I'm assuming this is a band, but I like the name of their tour. I found this The Point Skate Shop tee. I guess it's a local skate shop here in Dallas. Keep on pushing, I like their logo. North Face tee for $2.99, size 2XL. Nothing crazy, just your little mountain logo. Here's a vintage San Antonio, Texas stripe tee, size XL, $2.99. Nothing crazy, but I figured I'd show you guys. Here's this New York Yankees uh, Lee Sport sweater. I'm actually surprised because it's only $1.99. Usually stuff like this in here is like $8.99 or something. So I don't know why they price this one so cheap. $3.99, got the Pro Player, size 2 XL, um, Texas Tech pullover windbreaker these have the little logo right there like that's basically it nothing else going on on this one this one's kind of cool we got the colorado t that one's xl for 2.99 that one's single stitch old haynes tag here's a couple things i found in the dvd section uh, we got what i still think is the best grand theft auto to this date no matter how many times they update five san andreas will always be my favorite uh, that one's 2.99 and then this uh my bride is a mermaid i don't know never heard of it <laughs> I don't know who the Easy Rider Bike Club is, but I can appreciate the fact that they use Sweet Tooth from Twisted Metal as their uh, mascot. <laughs> Here's a Signal Sports New Mexico tee. 
nice graphic on it. And that one is 395, size medium, signal sports tag. I wish the graphic went all the way around the back, but it doesn't. It's just on the front, unfortunately. So for 295, size XL, I found the P. Diddy Presents, the Bad Boys of Comedy Tour tee. That one is on the Anvil tag. Grab that one anyway. Found this Flight Club hoodie. I don't know if the graphics are going to come up on the, in the video because it's like black on black. It does have like grease stains all over it. I can imagine how much this retails for considering how overpriced their shoes are. This is probably like a $100 hoodie new. I got two of them for some reason. All right, guys. So um, I forgot to charge my camera. So I'm actually going to be using my phone for these next couple clips. <laughs> so yeah, let me know um, if you guys like this quality better because... Um, if y'all do, I can switch to start using my phone more. But anyway, got the Davis Denver Broncos jersey. That one is a size 54 starter. They went $3.99 on it. Um, on the back, the numbers are pretty cracked and faded. But I don't know, for four bucks, what do you guys think? And then I also found this uh, Pink Floyd bonehead. I guess it's a um, radio station from here. And that one is a XL for $8.99 on the Gildan tag. Nothing amazing, but eh. I might pick it up. I also found the uh, Pittsburgh Panthers satin jacket. Size small for $3.99. Nothing on the back. All you got is a pit right there on the chest. They have this iPad, 20 bucks, right? Um, A1395. It says not tested, but I don't understand why all they did, couldn't do was just push the button. <laughs> but I mean, it looks like it works fine. Like it looks like it hasn't even been set up yet, so. Probably gonna go ahead and take that one. They have this uh, Kingdom Hearts wall scroll, but I mean, you can tell it's pretty bootleg because if you get closer, super blurry. Uh, they want seven bucks for that one. And then on top of that, it has nothing like no writing or nothing on the bottom. That's probably about like how much you can get it for on eBay. A pair of Parlay Ultra Boosts, as you guys can see. Size 11, they want 25 bucks for them though, which is basically what they're worth. So probably gonna pass on those. The sorting hat from Harry Potter for $13. <laughs> also found this um, Ariana Grande tour sweater for $3.99. Don't know what it's worth, but sure it's worth at least four bucks. Found this Loyal King tee. Never heard of the brand, but I thought it was kind of cool just because um, you got Mojo Jojo from the Powerpuff Girls. And then on the back, you have their brand and no one ape should have all this power. Now one's $2.99. Found the ReZero tee right here. You got Subaru carrying Rim through the forest. That one's a size small for $1.99. Great scene and good anime in my opinion. And then I also found the um, Ghost Recon Breakpoint polo shirt and that one they're asking a dollar 99 for on the dgk uh, baseball jersey it's medium 5.99 six bucks i don't know it's got the little dgk right there on the chest and the patch on the sleeve and then here's a corn huskers jersey by adidas 2xl seven bucks number 10 and you got the huskers patch right there on the chest we got the odd future playstation t four bucks though Found this bag with some toys in it. As you can see, it's got a yellow Yoshi and a Pancham in it for uh, three bucks. So I'll probably just go ahead and grab it. Figure dollar fifty each. It's worth it. A couple of cool uh, cups I found. The uh, vintage Beauty and the Beast one. The Animaniacs one, which this one I might actually pick up because I really do like this one. That one's dated ninety four. This Bugs Bunny Looney Tune one. And then the uh, Tiny Toons Dizzy Devil Cup from 93, the GOAT movie. If you haven't seen it, what are you doing? So that's going to bring us to the end of this week's trip to the thrift, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, hit that like button. It lets me know and it helps the channel grow. Go ahead and drop a comment down below and hit that sub button. And I will see you guys soon with another one. So, later. I'm a chef,